Now with a new look at season two of Dave, the most watched comedy series ever on FX. The show is hilarious. Trevor Alt sat down with the show's creator, rapper and comedian Dave Bird to talk about success and what's next for him on the show. Trevor, good morning. Good morning again, Wit. Dave Bird has had one of the most unusual and absurd career paths in recent memory, from ad agency account manager to joke rapper viral sensation, now to TV star. But he told us years ago he thought he was destined to be an iconic comedian and an iconic rapper, and somehow, so far, the plan seems to be working. Sometimes I feel yeah. The satirical rapper turned TV star, known by his rap persona Lil Dicky, spent the pandemic shooting season two of his semi-autobiographical show, Dave. It's gonna be the biggest name in hip hop. About a charming but high-strung man convinced he is destined for rap superstardom. My life on paper couldn't be better. I'm actually a rapper. Following up a record-setting debut that rolled out just as the pandemic hit. What's it like to have a hit show where everyone in America is at home? It is probably a good time to have a hit show come out in general, you know what I mean? Like, I'm not naive to the timing of it. Everyone probably had like a really rough year, but I'm happy that I was able to provide like a, a momentary I laugh for 30 minutes type of escape, you know? Along the way, Dave has become FX Network's most watched comedy series ever, winning over celebrities from Olivia Wilde to Henry Winkler to LeBron James. Was there a particular endorsement of your show that meant the most to you? LeBron. I hate to, How could it not be? I hate to pick favorites, but... Uh, you know, it's LeBron James. His show boasting cameos from Justin Bieber and Kendall Jenner. How about dream celebrity? Barack Obama's, I just wonder like now that he's not the president, like what he's allowed to like say. But beneath the star power and the frequent crude humor Dave is known for, critics have praised the show for its exploration of deeper topics. We've got the first hype man that's clinically depressed. Mental health and body image, race and privilege, along with the value and cost of radical self-confidence. There are a lot of insecurities that I have in real life that I've been able to just like almost let go of because of like announcing them on national television. I had like three dreams as a kid, being a comedian, playing in the NBA, being a rapper. One of them comedian felt like remotely feasible. Yeah. Um, and the fact that the other one also came true <laughs> means that like, I don't even feel comfortable ruling out uh, the NBA yet. <laughs> right. Who knows what medical technology will be? Exactly. About. Let's not like science. Like I could like, they could build new like hamstrings for me, you know? <laughs> And you can watch new episodes of Dave Wednesday nights at 10 on FXX or stream them the next day on FX on Hulu. Tonight's new episode pairs Dave with another celebrity with an unbelievable career arc, Lakers great turned writer Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Wow. We're not going to hold our breath for Dave in the NBA, but the show is hilarious and so is he. <laughs> All right, Trevor, thank you so much.